1996 was the year when I got addicted to games. Uh, I can praise only one game for that. Games like Metal Slug, Broken Swords, Star Wars, Twisted Metal, Time Commando, The Neverhood, that I like a lot, couldn't make it on a list. A lot of gaming standards were set in 1996 that apply even more than 20 plus years later on. A revolutionary year for sure. At spot number 10, we got Blood Omen Legacy of Cain. The very first Legacy of Cain game deserves the spot on top 10 list. After all, this franchise is one of my favorites. Spot number 9 Final Doom. The main difference between Doom and Final Doom. 64 new maps, 64 new brutal maps. I had a lot of fun, I hope you will too. Spot number 8 is Pandemonium. Great game for hardcore platforming fanatics, not that great for casual players. Spot number 7 We got Quake, Quake 1 if you want to call it. Another run and gun title, kill everything that moves on the map and have a lot of fun while doing it. Graphics are completely outdated since it's a 20 years old game, but it still provides smooth experience and a lot of fun. Spot number 6 is the Can 2. What can I say about the Can 2? I uh, was deciding if I should put Mortal Kombat Trilogy or Tekken 2, but I really think that Tekken 2 deserves this spot because it was a new title. Spot number 5. Civilization 2. It's another classic from my Microprose design team. I remember spending 20 plus hours in a day playing this game as a kid. You want to play old masterworks? Well, here's one. Spot number four, Tomb Raider, the very first Tomb Raider, developed by Core Design and published by Eidos Interactive. A lot of critics said that Tomb Raider is one of the best games ever made, and on top of that, it sold 8 million copies worldwide, believe it or not. This game served as a template for many action-adventure games that would follow. Spot number 3. Resident Evil. The very first Resident Evil. This is the father and mother of all survival horror games. Same what I said for Tomb Raider applies here too. Resident Evil is fundamental for all survival horrors and a must play. Spot number 2. Warcraft 2 Beyond the Dark Portal. Warcraft 2 is by far the best real time strategy in 96. Huge campaign, great story, a lot of action with a lot of building options. Spot number 1. My favorite game of all times, not only in 96. This is the game that I can thank for loving games at all. I have full review for Diablo 1 on my YouTube channel. I also got playthroughs, walkthroughs, all the bosses, all missions, all quests. Go check it out if you can. I'll say only one thing about Diablo. Diablo is the only reason why I started to love video games and it's my favorite game of all time. Think about it. This year, 96, gave us Warcraft 2, Tomb Raider, Resident Evil, Pandemonium, Quake, Diablo, Broken Sword, Metal Slug, Star Wars, Twisted Metal, Time Command, and many, many more that you'll see on a list right now. Stay tuned and I'll be seeing you on the next one.